Hi, this is Jason with Dave's Computer Tips with another how-to video for you. This one's on how to manage saved Instagram posts. Last week I put out a video talking to you how to save your Instagram posts. This time I'm going to show you where they're saved to on your Instagram account and some of the things you can do with them. Not everything, but I'll show you some of the little tricks you can do to manage them and organize them in this video. But before we get going, please hit the like on the video. It helps out our channel. Also hit the subscribe and the notification bell so you don't miss out on any, any new videos we put out. All right, so let's get this started. So what do we need to do first? So we need to go find Instagram. So we'll do that real quick. We'll go up here, tap on the Instagram app right there. And then once you open your Instagram account, you're gonna look for, you actually look to the bottom right, like we normally do, to go to your profile image. So you're gonna tap on your image right there at the bottom, right? And then it's gonna open up your profile. I'll give it a second. There we go. Our profile is open. You're gonna look to the top right for the three lines for the menu. You're gonna tap on that. And then once you do that, you're going to look for saved on the menu. So that's what we're looking for. We're looking for saved. That's where all your saved posts are hiding. Okay, now this is where all your saved posts are sitting. There's a couple things you could do here um, to start out. As you can see, you have some categories already created. And I showed you that in the last video that you can actually create a category. Or actually, sorry, it's called a collection. I should get the wording right. So that's what you're gonna do. But the first thing I wanna show you what you can do when you're in this area for your saved posts, you're gonna hit the plus sign at the top right. And this actually lets you choose from all the posts. It will give you all the images from all the saved posts you have, from all the collections, and you're gonna be able to choose them. So if this is basically the place where you can choose from all the collections, so we're gonna say, I wanna take that collection, that collection, and that collection. So they're all gaming collection. And then this will move them all into a new collection. So if you want to create a whole new collection, you can do it this way by just tapping the next now. And then you can name your collection. And you can change the change the cover. It's basically, it will open up the, the post that I'm trying to save. In this collection, you can just pick a different cover photo. So you can tap on one and it changes the cover photo. Very simple. Just type your name in, uh, whatever name you want, and hit add. And that will add a whole new collection so basically it's like having a new file folder where you can you know like make a file folder for gaming so the same thing that's what this does it lets you save your posts in a different one so that's easy to do so you can do that here that's one of the options you have in here to manage your stuff just keep going back hit the x it will take you back here now if you're here now open one of the collections that you've already created so we're going to go to let's go to this one okay that shows basically the ones i was doing um, what you do when you're in the collection itself, you have a couple of choices. I like to start with the three dots at the top. If you tap here, and if you look at the bottom, it says select. Click, tap on that select option. That select option gives you two, two other options right here. What you can do is see how the circles appear next to each of these again. You can select them. So if I select one of them, I can remove from this area. So I can remove from save. So I will, that will no longer be a saved part of my collection or you can move it to a new other collection. So you tap on move, the one I selected, I can move it to a different one or create another collection by tapping the plus sign. They give you a lot of options to create more collections or as I like to call them, file folders, because <laughs> that's what they are, um, to organize your saved posts. It's very nice to have, it's very easy to use. Okay, now we're gonna, since we selected, we're gonna hit the remove from saved. So we're gonna tap on that. Now it's going to give you this is remove from this collection. Posts will still be saved in all posts. So it will only remove it from this collection is how that works. So if you were wondering if how that works, so I'm going to hit remove. It removed it from this one. And that's one of the um, managing tools you have in here. There's also, let's see, if you have create guide, I've never done this part. So you guys might want to mess with this. I'm not going to be going over this too much in this video, but I'll tap it so you can see what it is. So if I create guide, a guide has to have so many pictures in it, so I'm not going to go in that. I'll do another video on how to create a guide in your in your in your Instagram save post area, but I'm not going to go into that. But if you guys want to mess with that, go go for it. So we're going to go back one more. This is now we've done that. So now that's basically how you do it. There's nothing. There's not a lot of other things to do here. This is more like moving posts around, deleting posts. As you can tell, that one went away. Let's see if that one's a good one. See, it still has the one I removed from the other one, so it did stay in here, which is good. Um, and that, I think, oh, you can edit your collection. That's, I think that's what this one does. So if you edit your collection, that's another option you have. You can actually hit it and you can change your cover image. 
you can, I think you can change in the name of it, but let's see. No, it says, so you can change your cover. So, hey, we're learning together here, guys. Um, so it's name tests. Oh, so you can change it here. So under name, you can change the name here. You can delete collection altogether. So there's a couple things you can do right here, but and if you're happy with what you did, hit check, and then it saves it like that. So you can change the name of any of your collections very simply to do that. So that's how you manage your Instagram posts on your Instagram account. Very simple, not too hard, but get in there, mess with it, and um, have some fun, guys. Make sure to check out davescomputertips.com uh, where all, all our articles are, and make sure to subscribe to this channel. And thanks for watching.